Hi, I'm Robert Riggs with Clarity, and we're here at SEMA 2017 with Mike Ring, the older half of the Ring Brothers, which, which I think I'm best described as the Michelangelo's <laughs> of car yeah. customizing. Well, so, thank you. Let me talk to you about passion. What is the passion that, you know, you go through here, there's tens of thousands of people in here. What is that passion? You know, I, I think you're, you're, you grew up with it, or you, uh -huh. you were influenced by something or someone at a very young age. And for us, it was, uh, you know, just wanting to get out of a small town and trying to find yeah. a way to get out of there. And it was, it was amazing. So behind me is what I call an old school for us. Uh, restoration yep. and truck customization. And we baby boomers, we love that. Mm -hmm. So what was it in that car that you were doing it for yourself that why you wanted to do it? You know, we'd done so many cars and we really hadn't been known for doing any trucks at all. And, uh -huh. you know, what's nice about it is you didn't have to get super crazy and it wasn't to make a statement or anything. It was just about making a cool little truck for, for mm -hmm. the shop. So using the full, the original chassis to start with was, you know, not normal for us. And it was just fun. It was just fun. So, you know, you, you got a new wave coming up of millennials. Yep. What's their passion, and do you see them? Do you see millennials someday as adult, as older adults, being your clients? You know, I think the millennials are going to demand a whole different type of vehicle. I hope they do. I'm a little nervous that they will just take Uber everywhere and not even want a vehicle anymore. I don't know where it's going, but I hope they do. But I think the technology with these kids and what they're going to want. I mean, I mean, we're seeing it with the young guys we have working for us to be able to model things like I say in CAD and create a car maybe that's not even been out there it's it's, it's yeah. their dream and really with technology today there's shops like ours that can build anything so you see basically scratch, scratch customs coming cars. yes I, I really do I think people that have the money are gonna you know they have a dream and they're gonna uh -huh. want to be able to create it and a lot of the young people today could probably design their own car in some way that could bring to somebody and pull it off. So do you ever just pinch yourself and say, wow, how this happened? Yeah, I mean, to come from a town of 600 and and just think that people know who you are uh -huh. around the world sometimes, it's it's pretty crazy. So you ever drag a racer? Uh, no, not yet. I'm the kind of the one that's the, uh -huh. to do the body work and paint. My brother loves to just tear them up and chip them up and he doesn't care. I, I get yeah. a little bit upset with that but after SEMA then it's the pressure's off. Okay. Well hey I appreciate you talking to us and uh, understanding passion and the Millennials. Yeah thanks. Thank you. Thank appreciate it. Thank much. you.